We're here in the Messi and Poloni laboratory where they do all the testing to ensure that the specifications that they give are actually accurate. We've got some really high power machinery here, very expensive stuff. So I wanted to show you uh, this process because I think it's very fascinating. So what are we doing now? Uh, uh, they, uh, they, uh, they're using uh, these this, this special cables, which are very, very expensive cables. And they're made, made it just for labs, you know, there can be, uh, these two meters can be worth around, around roughly 150, under 70 uh, euros. Wow. Uh, so they are very, very expensive because they are supposed to be working just for lab. Mm -hmm. uh, in this case, we're going, you're using uh, the cables of our competitors, uh, Uber Asuna. Uh, so uh, this is to they, calibrate the machine it's a, it's here? A, yeah, it's a, it's a calibrating cable, okay. uh, just for making testing properly. Mm -hmm. So uh, there are uh, two different ways to do that, uh, but in order not to wear out uh, the two connections, which uh, if replaced could be very expensive, uh, we are using these two calibration cables. Mm -hmm. Did you know that viewers of Ham Radio Tube can save 10% off all your Messi and Poloni purchases? You can either order from Gigaparts or directly from Messi and Poloni. United States and Canada orders also directly from Messi and Poloni will get free shipping. All you have to do is use code KNMRD at checkout. So uh, these are, these are, this is a calibration kit according to Hewlett Packard or Agilent Technologies. And it has to be calibrated every two years. Uh, because we want to make sure that the calibration is, is the, exactly the right one. This is a calibration kit about a VNA, which has uh, a fair amount of money, and um, it wears up to three gigahertz, so it has to have a calibration kit of this size in order to, uh, to uh, go up approximately the, in a very, very good way. If you see something which is smaller than this, yeah, uh, you're, you're getting a toy. Like those? Yes, because the problem is that, that uh, the higher the frequency, uh, the, the bigger would be the difference between the real thing and, uh, and, uh, and what the, the instrumentation is going to show you. So uh, let us say that uh, making a, a proper calibration, hey, you, need re you really do need the right tools. So he's, uh, he's, uh, he's inserting now this one, uh, which is uh, not zero, but very, very close to zero. Uh, questo l'abbiamo comprato in, in America, vero? Yes, yes, these are, uh, we, we bought this, uh, this uh, special connector in the United States. Mm -hmm. And it's a very expensive one, and it's also something suitable for a lab. Okay. Yeah, I, I was asking for the price, you know, and said, oh, no, it costs a lot, you know. But uh, okay. anyway, it's, uh, it's an expensive one. It's uh, yeah. uh, this, uh, this is the, the, the female equivalent, mm -hmm. and this is the male equivalent. So it's a, uh, it looks like just an adapter, mm -hmm. but it's a very, very calibrated adapter. So something for making a very, very sharp measurement test on okay. the cables. So we're gonna zero out the machine first? Is so, that what happens? So it, uh, that's the way we're going to make the zero now. Facciamo lo zero adesso. So by inserting this, yes, on one of the two, of the two cables, mm -hmm. yeah. And, uh, and then the other, the other end. So now it's going to make the zero. Okay. Okay, I should have my file zero. I'm just going to zero. Tolgo il, lo si chiama barilotto, non so come si traduce. Yes, yes, it, 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 it's the barrel. Yes, the diner is going to, to take away the barrel. E mm sono -hmm. sicuro che questo è zero. Inserisco la matassa e ho la misura reale. So uh, after that, it will be sure that this is equal to zero. Mm -hmm. And uh, in, in, so that, I will be able to understand that in, uh, uh, in the coil we shall have the real, the real thing, you know, okay. the real test. Zero? Yeah, so it's zero, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, yes, uh, the, the, the American company is, uh, is uh, Fairview. Yeah, I'm making them a favor. It's an advertising, yeah. It's Fairview, yes, and making calibration kits, very expensive, but very precise ones. Uh. Okay, sure, sure. So this is just for attenuation. Yeah, then we can have the calibrations for return loss and pit instability. Mm -hmm. So we're testing the Ultraflex 7 Sahara here. And what are we looking at uh, with these numbers here? 
is a 21296, is a 430, 144 megahertz, 50 and 28 megahertz. Okay, and so this is showing us the Yeah, these are uh, these, attenuation. These, the attenuation, yeah. As you can see, it's a vibrating as because it's never stable, it's yeah. like that, you know. But as you can see, the damper are decibel, uh, they are stable. Yeah. Uh, what is moving is the, just the hundreds, the done thousands of uh, decibel, you know. Mm -hmm. That is the stable, the stable attenuation of this cable. This uh, this um, Ultraflex Seven Sahara. Yeah. So at 28 megahertz, we're 0.9 dB. <laughs> 50 yeah. megahertz, one and a quarter. Yeah. Two uh, meters were right. two dB. Uh, yeah. 440 were uh, 3.8 dB. That's incredible. And even 1.2 gigahertz were. 7.4, so. Yeah, so these are exactly. <laughs> that's pretty, that's pretty the, the, impressive. Yeah, it's a, it's a test for 100 feet. Yeah. So it's at 30.48 meters. And this is this is where you get, this is so this is how you test the cable. And, and when you go to like messy calc and you see the, exactly. the dBs of, of attenuation for whatever kind of cable you specify in there, I this, is, this is how they know that that information is right. So yeah. that's pretty impressive. Yeah. And now you know the rest of the story. So you know, if you buy from Messi and Poloni, you're getting cable that is rated for what you're actually gonna get. And they have very, very expensive uh, equipment here to test this stuff. So you can buy with confidence, it's great. So that's all I got. Thanks for watching Ham Radio Tube. We'll see you next time.